Ten rack. Oh man. Ten oh. rack versus Tron. So so I really wanted to see this. He's playing at least two Davriel in this. He's playing three Davriel in this. Um, I know this because I sold him two of them. Foils. Ooh. Pre-release foils. Because this guy got super lucky and got two pre-release Davriels <laughs> in his pre-release packs. But see, it's not it's not as good as a as a foil Narset, which is going for over forty dollars right now. That's true. <laughs> I, I did get a promo uh, to Fairy, which I immediately sold. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> um, against Mono Green Tron. This should be interesting. Obviously, I'm pulling for, you know, the rack deck. What? But Zach, like, Tron is your favorite deck. You always go for that deck. I hate Tron. I hate it. 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 Um... Let's see. Yeah, and they're going they're going into the dungeon of magic. All right. Uh, <laughs> let's see. So he's playing Snaring uh, Bridge. I didn't realize Pete Rack was playing Snaring Bridge. In the board, maybe. Um. No. He's oh, playing two, two in the main. main. Yeah, I mean you you lose to creature decks because like the quick decks as you get online super fast you just lose to like oh, burn. Yeah. Yeah, so it's that's like. Fair. You're just like, ha, you can't attack me because both our hands are empty. I actually hate this matchup. <laughs> <laughs> if Tron if Tron loses what? Tron loses what? Uh, I really hope that Tron loses. I don't think that they necessarily will. It's going to depend you, on... Are it. you willing to make a bet? <laughs> <laughs> if... If Tron wins, what happens? If Tron loses, what happens? Three, four, five, six, seven. If Tron wins, when we go to Portland, you have to take three shots again. If Tron wins? If Tron wins. When we go to Portland, we have to take three shots. Oh my god. Of our choosing. Oh no! <laughs> why, am, why am I in this? <laughs> Cause you hate Tron. I I do hate Tron, but good God, I almost died. <laughs> it was those were like triples. <laughs> no, regular shots, not double shots. Regular shots. Three, oh, okay. Three shots of our choice. Oh God, that stuff sounds awful. Okay. Uh, if Tron loses, we'll we'll convince we'll convince Vince to take three shots of our choice. <laughs> okay. You down? Yeah, I'll do it. All right, it's recorded on video. If if this doesn't do it, we'll, we'll find someone. We'll have like uh, John. If you're watching this and, and you lose, <laughs> I want my dad real <laughs> Wow! I'm kidding. Oh man, seems reasonable. <laughs> seems reasonable. Mm -hmm. Well, 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 like well oh man, Tron's mulligan though. So I mean, you're not you're looking too bad game one. Oh, if he doesn't know that he's up against Rack, I, he's yeah, he's in for a world of hurt. If he uh, goes below six. So I mean, while, while we're waiting for that, why don't you uh, why don't you tell Robert here the story of last time we went to Portland? <laughs> oh man. <laughs> uh, so four of us were playing Black Green X. Three of us were playing Jun. Great, so playing we were like, hey, we're gonna go take Jun shots, and we we took it because you all scrubbed out. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we all scrubbed out pretty hard. Um, so we ended up doing Sour Apple, Sour Apple Pucker. First. First. Like idiots. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then the second one... Y you got the Jaeger. I got... So they only had enough for one shot of Jaeger. Uh, so I got the Jaeger. Everybody and, else had Kraken. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody else had a good shot of Kraken. I was like, oh. Oh man, yeah. if you lose, you know we're gonna, we're gonna go back to Killer Burger. And we're, I'm gonna get that that UV Sangria for you again. Oh. Do not give me a triple. <laughs> I, I, I will not give you the triple. <laughs> I will not give you a triple Sangria, but one of the shots oh, God. is gonna be that UV Sangria. <laughs> yeah. So the red was the the UV Sangria, and the white was. They did a white, a white Russian. I made Brandon a white Russian shot. Yeah, we we did like a white Russian shot. It was. It was a long night after that. 
Actually, it was really quick. I remember getting to the hotel and, like, yeah. waking everybody up. <laughs> shuffle, 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 shuffle. Is it going to be one of these matches where, like, the match is only ten minutes, but... This I don't believe so. Mixing colors was not a great idea. If we would have done it in a different order... It would have been okay. If they did Sarah Arbor last, they would probably have been fine, because that was, like, the easiest and sweetest one. Dude, I ran into Liam the next day, and he was like, I am dying. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best. I'm not going to lie. As I pull, like, bottles of water out of my backpack, I'm just like, here, guys, you want some food? Look at me. You think this is my first rodeo? <laughs> it was my second. <laughs> Zach, Zach was like, mistakes were made in the first. <laughs> No, when we went to uh, GP Vancouver, we we walked by the pier, and we were like, "Hey, if oh we no. if we owe nine, we're all jumping in. We're all jumping into the water if we owe nine. Uh, if you all owe nine, or if one of you owe nine, if we all owe nine. All right, because it was it was our first GP, and like yeah. it was uh, we weren't." Uh, luckily, I picked up a win in the first round. <laughs> so, <laughs> did everybody else? Did everybody else like O three drop effectively? So, no, we actually played out all nine rounds, and it was probably it was the dumbest thing that we could have done. Um, <laughs> but like I said, it was our first one, so we just played out all the rounds. Um, I picked up a win round one. My buddy's opponent didn't show, <laughs> and the uh, the other guy, my other buddy. Lost. So he was like, uh, I looked at the, I was like, it's okay, we won, so we're not jumping in the water. Yeah. Um, but that night we, we drank a lot too. Uh, we didn't, we didn't, <laughs> we didn't drink nearly as much as we did in Portland. But, uh, we definitely drank. Okay! He's finally drawn his six card hand. I think that's a five card hand. I think he will again twice. Good. God! <laughs> Take it forever! Uh, All right, so who's on the play? God, I, re I really want Tron to win. Just, Tron, just ooh. to Tron's on the play. I really wish he had a map right there. Just so. Do you? Do you really wish yeah. Tron had a map? Yeah, just so John could be like, "Fuck you." Thoughtsies, ancient stirrings, Karn, Tron land. Is it? I can't. I can't tell. I thought we fixed this glare problem. Are they using shitty sleeves? Are they not using katanas? Shameless promotion. He went, he went to four. He went to four. Oh, dude, you can't go. You can't go. To oh, four. all right. Well, I, I, I feel that ten rec has a. Oh, the two from Tron lands though. Like, does he have another? Does he have another specific discard spell? Uh, if he has Raven's Prime, he'll pitch the ancient stirrings. If he top draws that third land, he sinks a Karn. Well, if he has Raven's Crime now, he can cast it twice. Does he have a second land in hand? He only has he has one land in hand. He's got a mutable. Okay. Yeah, so, no, then he's fine. Okay. So if he really wanted to just take him off, he goes yeah. Swamp, Raven's Crime, Retrace. Uh, Smallpox also works pretty oh, well. Oh, yeah. Smallpox also works pretty well. Uh, so sack a land, discard a card, sacrifice a creature, and lose a life? Yeah. Oof. So, so they all discard the card. So he kept the Ancient Strings? Yes. I mean, at that point, I think you do. Yeah. Like, if, I mean, if you had a shot to hit, like, Tron and then just stick Karn, I think you do that. But now you lost a land, I think you just Ancient Stirrings and try and hit your land drops. Yeah. Uh, and then he discarded Raven's Crime. Mm, I, don't, I don't think that's Raven's Crime. I think that's the one drop. Uh, oh, Chromatic Sphere, all right. I think it's the one drop enchantment of Shrieking Affliction? No, I think that was Raven's Crime. For sure. Alright. This is true. Okay, no true confliction. Oh, I'm looking at the top card, and that's small fox. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. So the one under that is Raven's Crime. Okay. So he says, Shrieking Affliction, he's got one <laughs> card in hand, so he's gonna take some damage. Yeah. Ouch. Crack for green. Draw a card. Oh, man. Ancient stirrings. Is this, is this even a thing now, Zach? Are we just gonna start betting on just like Tron matches? Uh, <laughs> <Just> <laughs> <laughs> I 
I'm going to start doing this now. Anytime there's a trial match and you're over, all right, Zach, we're going to start placing some bets. I mean, I've, I've pulled a decent amount of uh, losses out of prom. Like, I, yeah. I lost. Like, I just keep losing all the time. Um, I 2 0 then in Vegas with Jund, so. Doesn't my, always happen when it does. I was my only Tron matchup day one. <laughs> okay, so he says three, Davriel. Oof. Yep. So that puts him on a, effectively a four turn time clock? Uh. So Davriel. Let's make him discard a card. So during his upkeep, he takes he'll check, he'll two, take four. So he'll take five. Oh, string affliction is three? Yeah. Oh, okay. So yeah, he's so yeah, he's on he's on a four turn turn clock effectively. Well, three turn actually because of the Muta Vault. Ghost uh, quarter. So ghost quarter. Muta Vault uh, doesn't really do anything here, but I mean it, it well, Muta Vault upticks the the clock by one. Yeah, with yeah, the if, ghost if, quarter. Yeah, I would say if if he hits, yeah. So Urborg, Tomb of Yagmoth. We're gonna have to start specifying that. <laughs> what? What? It's the only modern legal herb orb. Dude, it's gonna feel weird to play like Yogmoth and then herb orb in the same <laughs> Like, ah! Expect he says hello to you. <gasps> Tyra! <laughs> <sighs> we, we make him cosplay when they do commentary. Yeah, it's kind of dumb. <laughs> Except for that one time I was at night and I kept like flipping the visor down. I mean, we, we, next match, we can go get you the Knigget like, yeah. we, we can go get you the Knigget Helmet. Yeah. You, you can start going on Crusades. No, I get, that gets real hot. It's kind of summer right now, so... The, the AC's right there. Yeah, the mic's right there, too. It actually doesn't affect the mic, which is nice. Yeah. Mm, not really. Anyway, Tron's online. Doesn't matter. No cards in hand. He's at six. Urborg. And now John's just kind of like, yeah, go to one. I also realized that the mic actually was falling over down on the stand. I didn't pick it up after this. <laughs> and Tron yeah. scoops yeah. it up. Yeah. I am one one game closer to not <laughs> having to take shots. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so what are we doing? You want to just grab it and put it up on the thing for me since it's easier for you? Oh, shit. Yeah, so I said, it fell way down. It did. Asshole cats, man. I'm telling you. The cats are... They're not assholes. They're studying gravity. They're scientists. Oh god, it's like tangled in everything. <laughs> and I'm, like, I'm probably so close to this thing that I'm just like screaming in it. So. Yeah, yeah, it's not too bad. My apologies to everybody, and now I'm mushing it. That's why it sounds weird. Yeah, that's, why, that's, why this, that's why there's the cover on it. <laughs> it actually helps with a lot. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so. Oh man, I wouldn't have been sad about that. Yeah, Robert got the five lands and the and the Legion War boss. Uh, two people watch. <laughs> yeah. All right, so Tyler, do you have any embarrassing stories on Zach while we're uh, while we're waiting? Dude, Tyler and I went fucking hard in college. <laughs> so like super hard. hard. <laughs> um. Well, there was a night that I drank half a bottle of Kraken. <laughs> And, uh... First mistake. God, he, dr he drank something, too. I don't remember. Uh, but it was really funny, because I, I ended up locking myself out of my room that night. Mm -hmm. uh, while we went down to the uh, AUAP students. <laughs> yes, Tron needs to win this game. <laughs> Yo. Uh. Plus, no. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so I, I ended up locking myself out of out of my room, and we had to get the the RA, who I told him the wrong room, <laughs> had to go back down and get the other key, uh, and then if you also want to give us a follow as well, because Zach will be here most Wednesdays. We're gonna drag him out here. Yes, we'll start we'll start putting him in more embarrassing things like elf costumes. <laughs> what? <laughs> I didn't sign up for ooh, this. Ooh, ooh. Alright, anytime you have a camera match and you lose, chat will pick the costume that you wear whenever you do commentary for that day. Oh my god. I, I will do the same. 
I will do the same. My win record on camera is terrible. <laughs> I this <w> sucks. <laughs> I'm down if you're down. Chat, chat chooses costumes. If if I lose on camera, <laughs> chat, 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 I'll put costumes for the for the next time that we stream. All right. Good thing I'm not gonna be on camera for like three weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you going to be? I'd do it. Yeah. <laughs> I would. I, I was like, yeah. I'm going to start ordering some more costume stuff now. I'm just like, <laughs> we have fun on these streams. Alright, so, uh, boarding in, like, I grabbed the wrong list for this uh, overlay because Vince is running the uh, karn Microsoft lattice combo. Oh, of course. Which, I mean, why wouldn't you? I, I personally don't think it fits in the theme of Mono Green, but I get why you want to run it. Like, I, I think... Delirium Skies. I don't remember what that card does. Which one? Delirium Skies. I think each each player discards a card. Delir... Delirium Skies. I can spell. Each player discards three cards. Three, okay. It's, um, it's pretty good. The only downside is it costs three mana. It's a little slow in this matchup. But, I mean, it's not. It's not uh, there's not a whole lot of copies, though, is there in the main board? He's not running any in the oh, main. Oh, it's in the uh, sideboard. It's one it's in a, side. His entire sideboard is just like it one ups. Yeah. <laughs> Tron, Tron is boarding in a win. I like it. Um, Tron's like witch bane orb. <laughs> what fatal push comes out most likely? Yeah. And um, you put in. And Staring Bridges, I think, come out. Well, uh, yeah, Staring Bridges probably come out, too. Yeah, I think Bridge is too slow. So you, uh, you just bring in more hand control. So, uh, Wrench Mine. What, the Asylum of Brutality. Yeah. Brutality isn't great, though. You're, like, you can hit Ancient Stirrings, maybe. Oh, uh, yeah. Brutality's not great. Uh, Lily, uh, damn. Hey, Cyborg's Le not real great. Leyline of the Void's fine. Um. Is it? Yeah, I mean, Exile's the Graveyard. Like, it, it's better than Fatal Push. Yeah, what does that do for Tron, though? Is that a one of Death Shadow? Yep. <laughs> okay. Oh! Shadow of Doubt. Bring in that one of Shadow of Doubt. Oh, yeah, there you go. Be like, crack map. No! Yeah, uh, Wretch Mine. Like, Bontu's Last Reckoning wouldn't be terrible. Um... If, he, if he's... If, he's... <sighs> if, if we're just trying to, uh, take Fatal Push out, I mean, I think I would do... Asylum Visitor, Shadow of Doubt, maybe Wrench Mind. Delirium Skines is like a close fourth. If you had something else, that wasn't great. Yeah. Um, like, I don't know, Liliana's Triumph. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm going to tell Brandon that too as I see new deals. Oh, Brandon, Brandon's ever on camera though. Uh, he's also got one Ley Line of the Void in the main. I don't think I agree with that either. In, I mean, this, in this matchup. In this matchup. I was, I was like, eh. I think it's fine overall because, like, Dredge, Phoenix. Yeah. But in this matchup. Small card. Additional win cons. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, I can it see it, but I said, like, uh, most, most Tron lists are playing it as a playset, and I, I don't I don't agree with that. I think, like, two to three, I think, is where they want to be. Cause I, I can I can see you taking out like I know he took out like World Breaker and I think he took out a Worm, an O Stone and something else. And I was like, ah. Damn, Foil Narset's up to forty five dollars. Yeah. You buy a box of four. Karn's up to fifteen. Ashiot's doing pretty good. Liliana's doing pretty good. Blast Zone is still pretty good. Yeah. Teferi's still pretty good. Fuck, I should just buy a box of Spark. And then be we, like, we, I got no money. We bought a case and we did okay, but we also like we had, we had a like a box value that was like one seventy, like one eighty, because we had a foil in our set, foil Gideon in it, plus Lily, plus, like yeah. Man, which puzzle box? I think I got the Visions puzzle box, and I'm really glad that I did because it just jumped. Yeah, I mean it's Visions. It's part. Of, it's one of the better artworks. Yeah, because I just don't like white border cards, to be honest with you, and all of these look like shit. I mean, yeah. Oh, man, I'm just popular. All right, turn one, Tron land. Oh, Tron land. Star. All right, so like turn one. Th oh, that's a small pox. That's small pox is probably the best way to fight Tron. 
Just hands down. Herbivores. Uh, okay, so just and, boom. And rack. Turn one rack. Yep. It says, yeah, play all your cards. Do it. I mean, uh, do it, do it, do it, yeah. Do it, do it, do it. The thing I mean, he's gonna go turn two, like, smallpox, sack the herbivore because he has the second one in hand. Yeah. So, crack it for a green. Oh, another star. So no, oh, no stirrings. He kept one land. He kept a... Oh, no. Oh. I was looking pretty good for you right now. But I've not taken shots. Oh. Oh. Smallpox! <laughs> <laughs> Do it! <laughs> Zach's just like yelling. Get there! Just slam that shit. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Because you didn't see a second land out of him. Yep. He's like, and immediate concession. That's it. Concession. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> Woo! Oh. Uh, Tron 